Hi, and welcome to the Delphi how-to video series. My name is Philip Mitchell, and I'm the Service Operations Engineer here at Delphi. Today I'm going to show you how to use the Injector Solvent Cleaning Kit to diagnose and resolve early stage lacquering. This typically manifests itself with stalling, erratic idling, or poor starting when the engine is cold. If these symptoms are present and no fault is found during the common rail diagnostic procedure, then early stage lacquering may be present and will need addressing. First, set up the solvent gun with the cleaning solution provided. Be sure to make sure the gun is secure in position. Next, remove the high pressure pipe using the appropriate tool. Be sure to cap any connections to prevent contamination. Next, remove the injector electrical connection and the injector battery pipe. Taking this bottle from our sealed rail kit, we can attach it onto the back leak connector on the injector. This will collect the used solvent and the lacquer deposits from the injector. Next, set up the electronic injector test kit using the correct cable supplied in the range. Next, attach the adapter pipe supplied in the kit onto the injector. Connect the green crocodile clip onto the green banana connection. And then attach this to the pipe on the injector. Next, connect the supply cables to the vehicle battery. Make sure the red goes to the battery positive and the black to the negative. For this test, the battery must be in good condition and capable of supplying 15 to 25 amp current. Attach the plug into the unit. For the last connection, this end to the injector, this end to the injector test kit. The electronic injector test kit will automatically detect the common rail injector coil type and go through the normal diagnosis process. The cleaning cycle can then be activated for each injector. Next, attach the solvent cleaning kit to the vehicle. Be sure to use the correct nozzle supplied in the kit. Connect the syringe to the electronic test kit, ensuring a good connection. Activate the cleaning cycle and then pull the trigger to introduce the solvent. Repeat this process until clear fluid is present in the back loop. Repeat this process for all injectors and allow the solvent to act for one hour only. Timing is important as prolonged soaking can cause seizure within the injector due to the two surfaces becoming bonded. After one hour, repeat the cleaning process introducing the fresh solvent. This will clean out any particles or deposits. After removing the test kit, be sure to replace the high pressure pipe with genuine parts. When fitting the pipe, ensure the correct torque is applied as to the manufacturer specification. Connect each electrical injector connector and then start the vehicle. With the engine running, collect the fuel in the back leak collectors. Stop the engine, reconnect all back leak connectors and remove all test equipment. And that's it. Once the cleaning process is complete, we can now re-enter the C2I or C3I code using the Delphi DS diagnostic tool. And that's it. That's how to clean a common rail injector using the Delphi Solvent Injector Cleaning Kit.